In this tutorial, we will learn how to use the split command. This can be used to either split faces or to split solid bodies within a model. And so as we can see here, I've drawn a basic part. I've drawn in a sketch profile on this plate in here. We will use that as our split line. So let's go to 3D model and under the modify panel, we'll select split. We have a small dialog box pop up. Now, first we need to input our tool. Uh, this can either be a plane or a sketch profile. So I will select the sketch profile that I drew in here. I'll select that. And then for faces, we need to select which faces that we wish to split. And so to start with, I'm just gonna select these three faces here and select OK. And as we can see, I've split these faces up. So I've got a total of six faces now uh, as they intersect with our sketch profile. I'm going to delete that and I'm going to reselect our sketch profile, but instead I'm going to select all faces. So every face that's intersected by our sketch profile will be split. So like so, the exact same principles as before, we have two uh, faces uh, based upon where our sketch profile has intersected the model. I'm just going to show you one last uh, demonstration, which is by turning on the solid selection. So first let's select the tool. Let's use the same sketch profile again. And under solid selection, Inventor has already selected this solid for us here. Uh, when we know that because under the solid bodies folder, there is only one solid to choose from. And we have some behavior options here. So if we wish to discard one side or the other, we can do so. But for this demonstration, I will keep both sides and select OK. And now if we look at our solid bodies folder, once again, we can see there are now two bodies and we can choose to uh, change their visibility. And we can even apply different properties uh, to each of these solid bodies. So for example, if I select solid body 18 and solid body 19, we can see here that I've applied uh, two different appearances to each of the bodies. So that's a summary of the split command. If you have any questions, please put them in the comments section. But aside from that, I will see you in the next tutorial. Thank you.